Millsy, off the grid down under, South West Western Australia. Well, did a bit of ram and earth today, and the new system, I have to say, is um, far superior. Instead of uh, six and a half, seven hours, but we did that wall the other day, um, knocked this one out, started mixing about 7.30, and it knocked all out by 20 past 11. Got to be a bit of a wreck ward. And it went together like clockwork. A couple of few different things for you if you're ever going to ram earth and you're setting up your own formwork and that. I'll just give you a bit of a run through. So this is the um, the other wall. And um, yeah, I have to say the, the quality is starting to get up there a bit. Um, that's, that's going to be the best wall. You can hardly even see the, uh, the joins there. Um, yeah, the mix is good. Only thing is, a bit of that them little black dots is that coming off that black formwork. So ultimately, what I'm going to do is, um, is I'm going to build a whole new lot of formwork and coat it in resin clear ones with resin. Um, what I did is I drilled those holes out a bit bigger and um, yeah the rod slipped through beautifully. Thing slowed us down up the top was that steel so that's the last time I'm doing steel I'm gonna make knock one of them up with a with one of them LVL beams on it. Um, another thing uh, we did couple of things I did normally um, normally I'm ramming up the top of these 2.7 walls I have this uh, red uh, milk crate and, and I'd be dancing with Daisy up there on that but the problem with it like they say uh, you can cut the uh, cut the length of Daisy down a bit but the problem is up there up high and standing on that that milk crate I'm reaching up to the uh, handle is at the top of the the air thing at the top of Daisy air is um, is up the top and uh, it's a bit hard to reach that and when she starts bouncing you sort of can't reach I'm just not tall enough big enough bit of a bit of a failing of I've been born a bit shorter um, yeah, so what I did, um, we were shoveling from Billy's bucket. Normally we would have that platform there and we'd shovel the dirt over into the into the forms, but um, because that was wide and there wasn't that much um, bars in the middle, just the two end bars, we got on the form on the other side and shoveled, just brought Billy up to there like they normally do, um, and just shoveled from the other side. So we just stood over here and shoveled it from Billy's bucket straight over there so we weren't standing on that form bringing Billy's bucket up to there and um, and shoveling it in you know full shovels over the top and in the end Billy's bucket reached up to that 2.7 so I, I, I was talking to another guy and he said he's he got a, a backhoe he, um, he shovels from the backhoe bucket I mean does the daisy from the back, uh, backhoe bucket so I thought yeah if Billy's up there I'll give it a shot stood in the bucket and rammed the last little bit up the top there worked beautifully yeah so we're learning and uh, and progressing so that was knocked out pretty well um, the, the mix didn't dry out much because we got it done pretty quick um, kept turning the mix over keeping it live It'll be interesting to see how that wall turns out. Yeah, so um, the plan is to put a put a big double doors over that side. Um, maybe a window in there, a big window in there, and the door, the entrance door is um, is here. So um, not sure whether to just round that wall, but my dilemma at the moment and travelling and doing it all from Billy's bucket might be the answer but my dilemma as I said in a previous video in the middle here it goes up to 3.3 .3. that's the 
that's 2.7, so it's another 600, like one of them 600 lifts above that. So I suppose I could stand in Billy's bucket and shovel it in and ram from Billy's bucket. Um, yeah, another challenge and sort of figuring out how to get the height of the 3.2. I suppose you just put a steel rod in there and you're going to have a rod going to the top anyway and just measure the rod and draw a bit of string across I suppose and get the angle. I was thinking of laying it all out on the ground and getting an angle and cutting the wood but um, let's see how we go. Anyway, that's it for today. Um, beautiful autumn day. Not a cloud in the sky. Feel for the poor people over east. Had a bit of rain. A bit of rain's good. We had a bit of rain a couple of weeks ago. It's starting to dry out again over the valley there. It's starting to brown off again. So, um, yeah, send us a bit of rain from over east. We could welcome it here. A bit more would be good. Anyway, don't forget to like and subscribe and share. Just a little update today. And we'll catch you in the next video. Take care and we'll catch you then.